thank you, Missouri City, uh, for uh, giving us the opportunity to better serve you. Uh, I want to thank our mayor and city council for giving us the resources. I want to thank our employees. Uh, I'm Otis Jones, your city manager. We're happy to have this resource, uh, this new truck, that will allow for us to provide better service to you. We're going to buy this new piece of equipment. Uh, thanks to uh, the mayor and the council giving us those resources. We're going to go out and uh, start uh, working to improve your streets and the sanitation in your community. With the purchase of this new truck, it's going to uh, allow us to really improve our efforts towards the beautifications of our city streets. It's smaller, easier to maneuver down some of our tight streets that we have, our cul-de-sacs. Our plan is to deploy it during the working hours when we can get up to the curbs, get them nice and clean. So when you come home from work, when everyone goes back to work, that you'll come home to nice, clean city streets. We really appreciate the opportunity to sir, upgrade our service to the citizens of Missouri City. Uh, what uh, Mr. Harris and his team and Mr. Tubbs and his team will do, as I said, they'll get out there quicker and easier uh, with the ability to dump, as Ms. Kenlock mentioned, uh, that uh, we will be able to make quicker trips around the city. So rather than seeing maybe two or three trips a day, you might see up to six or seven trips a day. So uh, we we'll look forward to the increased service. And uh, if you have any comments or questions about the service, please give us a call. I want to thank Missouri City so much for your business. And thank you so much, Mike, and uh, the whole Public Works Department for this opportunity. My father started uh, Kinlock Equipment over 25 years ago. We are the representative for over 10 lines of equipment. We're the dealership. Uh, for all of Texas. The machine behind me is the Elgin Broom Badger. The Broom Badger uses, uh, just like Mike was saying, it uses a mechanical type of technology, which is your basic broom and dust pan technology. You'll see on each side there are large, two large side brooms. These side brooms scour and spin inside of the side of the road or the gutter area. That's where most of the debris and material gather side brooms spin and move the debris into the center of the truck where the large main broom at the back spins and flicks the material up into the dustpan section or the elevator and brings it up into this uh, large four cubic yard hopper. This hopper uh, gives the city a, a lot of different ways they can dump this machine, makes it more efficient. So they can either dump directly on the ground or as high as 11 feet and anywhere in between. So that means they can dump their debris into any sort of container or roll off while they're still working so they don't have to go back to a dump site. That makes the job a lot easier and it makes it a lot more efficient. This sweeper is especially popular amongst our customers because it has a very low profile. It has a very short wheelbase, which makes it turn very easily. It's really good for narrow streets, neighborhoods, and highways alike. Lastly, I want to talk about the advantages of street sweeping. So the first is it reduces pollution and drainage issues. If you leave debris in the gutter, rainstorms will uh, move that debris and it will go down drains into your stormwater. This can cause drainage issues. It can also cause pollution. So Missouri City is being very proactive. They're getting that debris out of the street and into this hopper. So it reduces some of that pollution. And lastly, it keeps Missouri City beautiful. It keeps the residents happy when they see their clean streets and it's great for tourism as well. Feel free also too to reach out to our communications team or directly to my office, the city manager's office, at any time. You can also too shoot me an email at otisodis.jones at missouricitytx.gov. If you particularly would like to have more sweeping, sweeping done in your neighborhood or if you see something that you think uh, uh, could add to our efforts.